Good morning, everybody. I'm going to try an ultra wide. There's not going to be a lot of vlogging outside today. I can tell you that much, but you can see I'm coated up pretty heavy because we have 100% chance of rain for the next, I think, uh, five, six, seven hours. Yeah, it's supposed to rain to like six o'clock at night, five o'clock at night. But this little guy's got to go to the vet and get his beak trimmed. So, and it is that time. Cover him up so he doesn't get wet. Hopefully I can grab a hold of the cage somehow this way. We'll get him covered here. But, uh, still trying to, I got the second part of the video imported, but a lot of that's going to get deleted. When I get back home, I'll finish it up. So, <clears throat> hopefully we don't have to wait a long time for this today. Uh, Ria's like, what's going on? Why are you leaving without me, Dad? Yeah, we're going to try ultra-wide. So the weird thing is I get 57 minutes of record time on the internal. I get 122. That's in standard D-warp. I get 57 minutes. In ultra-wide, I get 122 minutes. So I'm not sure why, if anybody can explain to me what the difference is. I don't really like how he's sitting in here. Hold on a second. It's okay, Jersey. You okay, buddy? It's like, what's going on, man? out of the way and then one and falling oh I covered you guys up too sorry about that and unfortunately the suction mount is well it's in here but I don't have a magnet mount on it because I had to use them last night and Tim backed the seat up because he was driving oh oh god I'm all the way in the back here where can I sit this can I sit this like this maybe with the Pepsi cup that's been in here since I went to Sam's Club. Maybe just one more click. There we go. Alrighty, a little different angle. You got smuts on you from the rain. <clears throat> oh. Yeah, yesterday was a, a complete bust. Forgot the filters of one, and then Christmas lights were all out. I don't know if I'm gonna attempt it. It's supposed to stop raining tonight. Like I said, around five, but I don't know if I'm going to try to, um, maybe when she leaves, try to at least get out and do the couple ones that I wanted to do. The roof mount, I, w I want to see the footage back. I haven't seen any of the footage uh, on the computer yet. Uh, I know a lot of it's going to get wiped, oops, because um, I was just trying to keep the cameras active on the roof, because I had his phone and my phone both running, so... Just trying to keep the cameras active and not have them time out so i was hitting record occasionally but they were going they, they were on the roof at 60 miles an hour going down the beltway so it's a it'll work now my car might need a little different angle uh but that's what i'm going to do going through the grove i'm just gonna I, i'll probably pull one of them back off so i can have my suction cut or my yeah my suction mount back um sorry my eye sinuses and everything today are good a nightmare is I, I took I actually took a Zycam and my um, uh, this guy go yeah I'm trying to think I, my, I didn't take the Afrin yet I really probably should take my Afrin but the uh, Mucinex a Walmart branded one so I'm using right now so all right we are here Unfortunately, with this little guy, we try to go five weeks, and uh, his bottom beak is almost into his chest. <laughs> it's okay, buddy. <clears throat> They'll fix you up. We'll make sure they get the bottom and the top. Yeah, boy, you can see how crooked that is, I think. If I look through the bars, they're so crooked. Poor guy. It just randomly happened. He was fine for a long time, then all of a sudden his beak just started growing like this. It happens, apparently. It's rare, but it happens. Alrighty, well, that wasn't too bad. It's, uh, we got there at 10 o'clock, and it's, I don't even know what time it is. 10.22. Doesn't, it, well, it was pretty long. It took her a little bit longer today to, she actually trimmed it with little clippers. <laughs> God. And then, uh, this guy is parked crooked next to me here. There are a lot of people that don't know how to park their big ass, they buy a big ass vehicle and then they don't know how to park the damn thing. Oh, all right. Now, 
sneak home here and try to get puppies so I can close the door for her. She can go to bed. Uh, I don't even I don't even get on the road here. I just stay on the median as long as there's no one coming down. And then right back in our road. <laughs> yeah, it's uh it's not very nice out today. Oh boy. I don't know. Part of me wants to make chili and there's part of me that does not want to go to all these to get the stuff to make chili. Because she said we have some of this stuff, but I want to see the packet and literally just get everything like I normally do. And I'm trying to think if I used to make a six pound version or a six pound or a three pound. I think six. So I'm only gonna do half a batch. I'm gonna use the roaster if I do it. We'll see. Gotta finish up the video. I really should get the chili going here uh, sooner than later, but I should be able to get the video edited the rest of the way and then get it rendering and then we can go and you know, while it's doing that and then get home and export. All right, video is rendering. So, Priya and I are going to all these. Hop in. I got the, come on, hop in. There you go, good girl. Today I was sleeping with mommy, I hope. I did hear him at the door once, but I just kind of ignored him. All right, it is, uh, it's raining pretty good. <laughs> I pulled out this Oakley jacket and uh, found the other glove I was missing and found another Under Armour hat that I knew I had. I just didn't know where it was. It's in this jacket. All right, I'm going to set the car mount back up because I took one of the attachments since I don't have two action cameras for the rest of the week. Uh, and uh, get this set up in the car. All right, well, I managed to make so I can reach the damn turn dial to loosen and tighten this, but it's so cold that this isn't spinning real easy anyway. It's kind of, it won't go. But if it's warm outside, this thing will, you go around a corner, this thing will actually, the cool head will actually rotate by itself. I didn't realize they made tripods too. All right, suction mount set back up. This works best for this car. I mean, I do have the other mount on here for the uh, pocket, but with it raining, you don't want that. And I don't know that ultra wide is the best lens. Uh, let's switch over to wide and see how that looks because honestly I think this looks a little bit grainier I don't know, let me know in the comments maybe when the video actually renders the rest of the way out and exports it'll look better but I might go with wide but with Christmas lights you kind of need the ultra wide to get across the street <laughs> hell I've been in standard D warp all day I guess now we're in wide now right, we're gonna test this out for the day I might save this profile it's kind of crazy though how um, the well the, can someone explain to me there is like a little piece of foam that came with I think the camera and it also came with the the, the surf mount and it's to tighten the camera up but you can't get it to lock into anything real well with it I finally peeled the damn thing off last night and it locks into everything so much better now I'm not really sure where it's supposed to go I had it on the bottom of the camera and I don't think that was right either it doesn't go on the mount doesn't go on here because it doesn't fit around the little rubber pieces. I don't know. I'm a little confused. I, th I don't know if this is the native. No, because ultra wide's got to be the native. I didn't see what my record time was. Let me take a look. Now I'm at an hour and 12 minutes. <clears throat> I don't know. But in standard deal warp, it was like, that if it was in standard the whole time, then it was, I don't know what's going on, why I gained so much time. I hope I don't have a motion. It's 4K 60 rock steady wide. Huh. I don't know. I don't even look at the... I mean, it's raining, so it, it could be snow, honestly, but... Hey, team, I had a call off tonight, and I wanted to know if anyone would pick up shift today. It would be 3, 30, 30. No. No, we do not. wonder who the hell called off. Anywho, I'm going in there. That's great. Hey, you want to work tonight? Sorry, dude. Making chili. Got plans. <laughs> yeah, not a very pretty day outside at all for us. So, I think it's a good chili making day. Yesterday would have been a waste not to, but unfortunately, everything went wrong. But I go back to what Tim said. We got to hang out, you know. Didn't get to exactly do what we wanted to do. 
course my belt broke so I, I'm hoping that was the belt that was already torn and not the one that wasn't but it just just ripped it right in half when Priya got snagged and I kept trying to pull her so it was it was quite the conundrum there alright here we go need a pack of green peppers basically all the fixings to go in it the tomato sauce the tomato paste all that stuff and then we'll be uh, going home and throwing the chip well first I'm gonna throw the turkey in and get it thawed yeah it's just a good day to stay inside it is it is miserable out here I am it is running really really freaking hard I hate to have to take Priya to go pee but I'm gonna she's gonna have to go pee at some point orange bug girl this is why I kind of wanted to cover the patio all, all the way and not have to take it down in the winter time so I could just leave it up so they could get outside but no I wasn't going to do that couldn't afford to do that anyway and once I started pricing the PVC it got too expensive alright we've got everything we need didn't really want to get the organic kidney beans but that's the only type of kidney beans we sell it's really weird It'll be fine. I got one low sodium chili mix and two hot. But I did get extra tomato stuff. I did get tomatoes, one can of tomatoes or uh, diced tomatoes with chilies. I love that. Green pepper. So there's going to be three green peppers in there. Uh, don't you dare cut me off there, jackass. Um, <clears throat> should be should be yummy, yummy. Okay, get that. I'm gonna put the turkey right in the roaster and let it start thawing out, cooking, browning. I last time I made it, someone I it might have been my boss that said he just throws throws the beef in and lets it all cook together. Terry did not really like the idea of me doing that way. It did work, but eh, I think I'm just going to um, brown it because it's frozen, so it's gonna take a while to get it to cook. So, and it's such a big pack that I'd have to get out a completely different pan and all that crap. So, I don't think it'll fit in that other roaster. I think it'll be too much. Because we do have the other, like, cro the, the, not the, I guess it's a medium-sized crock pot. I forget how many quart that is. And I think once you get three pounds of turkey in there, it's not, I'll, I'll check that before I get the big roaster out. Because I'm pretty sure I used to do six pounds, not three. All right, so I did watch a video on, you know, what is the focal lengths and whatnot. So it's funny because if you're in Rocksteady Plus, standard do warp, equivalent to 17 millimeter. Now, you mm, should be able to notice it. It does back out when you go to wide, still says focal length to 17 millimeter. Go to ultra wide, backs out just a little bit further, still says 17 millimeter. I thought the guy was actually out of his rocker, but then if you go to Rocksteady, it's 11, 12, and 15. So, stabilization on top of. Now, what is it if you turn it off? So, standard D warp is 14. Ultra wide is, or wide is 10. And ultra wide is 9. But you really don't want to do that unless you really like editing. Um, stabilization in post, which I personally do not. Oh, and I was also the hour and 22 minutes. Yeah, it was in standard bitrate when it's in that mode now. That has been fixed. It is in high bitrate. So if there's any bitrate problems with yesterday's video, we now know why. So I do have profile five, which was weird the other night because when I did this, it actually allowed me to yep, 57, 52. So if you turn it to standard, you get an hour and 22 minutes on internal drive. So that's the internal drive. I don't remember where I saw this, but saw it online at one point was when you're thawing meat, it's best to elevate it so that the air can get all the way around it and it thaws evenly. Obviously this has been out for maybe two and a half hours. It's nowhere near thawed. So, but I think we're just gonna use the crock pot. I think it's plenty big uh, for three pounds. I'm not going to go through all the, the whole process here with you guys, but basically I'm just going to put the put that in there and let it start thawing out and browning, and then we'll uh, we'll uh, start adding stuff in once it looks better. 
Alright, I finally broke down and threw the turkey into a skillet and got that browned up. And now I got everything cooking and it is 20 minutes of 2. So, have it on high heat. Let it cook that way for a little bit. I'll probably stir it a few times. And, uh, but yeah, three green peppers and I'll throw all the cans away. But, a lot of stuff in there. That is a full crock pot. Alrighty, everybody. It's still bubbling, even on low. It's a little juicy because I didn't drain everything like I was supposed to, but I kind of like it that way. I don't want it to be like a matted mess. But I'm going to give it a good stir here, and uh, I might actually turn it down to warm. Because I'm, I'm smelling it, so I'm almost thinking that it's actually ready for, for consumption. And I like to cook my chili like hours and hours, kind of like my pork and sauerkraut. So... Oh, I think the rain might have stopped. The tank is upstairs sleeping in my room. Priya's been snuggled up with me. I covered up with a blanket because I tucked your fur and she felt chilly, so. I do have the fireplace gone. And I'm on my third Christmas movie? I watched Home Alone 3 and now I'm watching A Christmas Kiss and now I'm watching 12 Dates of Christmas. Which I think was, it was a TV one because it keeps going to the black. I think Christmas Kiss is a TV one too. The original, the second one I didn't like. Might end up watching uh, Princess Switch too with um, Amanda Crossgrove. So, actually, the other one that she's in with uh, A Night for Christmas, that one's really cute too. I, I struggle finding new Christmas movies to watch. I don't like like the traditional. I almost watched The Grinch, but yeah. Uh, got a little mist. Hello. A little misting going on out here tonight. Uh. I got a new neighbor and they just lost their cats while they're moving in. Yeah, it's it's misting pretty good here. I don't know if you can see it. it just goes from bad for worse for the poor girl. She locked herself out on her first day here. Oh man. I feel bad for her. Unfortunately there's not much I can do for her. <laughs> Gave her the emergency number to have I don't think they'll even come down and unlock anymore. I think they call a locksmith to come over and unlock the door. So it's, uh, yeah, pretty bad. But anyway, okay, chili came out okay. I feel like I should have put some salt in it. Uh, it seems a little, I definitely have this, the, because I used the chili powder, I definitely have enough of that this time around, but it feels like it could be a little saltier to me. So, I don't know. Come on, little buddy. Oh, man. What a what a day. Just a nice relaxing day. Like I said, I watched three Christmas movies. I think I'm done now. I think I'm Christmas out for the right for the moment. <laughs> Bad news is Priya will not eat. She wouldn't get off the couch and, and get any food. So I don't know what her deal is. She was fine all day long. She didn't gulp nothing. She went outside. She was, you know, right with me and then got food around and she just laid on the couch and sulked. Of course I yelled at her because she was barking at the people moving in. I don't know if she feels like she was, uh, you know. I want to go this way instead, Mateo. No, come on. Let's go. Come on. You got to walk. You got to go potty. Yeah, I don't know. I, I was looking through, and I, I, I don't know if the comment is in another language or if someone says that I'm an asshole to my dogs, but uh, uh, okay. <laughs> I really don't know what I did to piss that person off. It's like, uh, I... And the way the YouTube comments, they've changed them. I finally found view all, so I could actually go through and reply to some. Because so I saw them popping up, but I couldn't find them. So, I don't know. Teach their own. Uh, we're going to go back to Standard e warp because I feel like he's so far away that he's not even visible. What are you doing, bud? Come on, let's go poopies. He's like, what are we doing in the rain, Dad? Alrighty, I got the one that won't eat. She didn't want to get off the recline or the couch. I picked her up nicely and put her down since I'm an asshole. And uh, I mean, she hasn't really been out to do a whole. I mean, she, I've sent her out to do potties, but she's not much for a patio potty dog. So give her a little bit of a walk to get her get her moving. Maybe she'll be hungry when she gets back. Oh, I think the drone light is dying. Uh, yep. <laughs> Alrighty, guys, I'm going to call it a night. Thanks for watching. Have a good night. Stay safe. 
If you're new to the channel, please subscribe, thumb up, and comment, and I will see you in the morning. Have a good night.